What's going on YouTube? This is your girl PK. I know it has been a long time since I've been on YouTube. There has been a lot going on and I know I say that all the time but it was and um, I want to say first and foremost I apologize to all my ladies that was on a seven week challenge finding tease challenge the seven week I went all the way until the fifth week I didn't do the sixth or the seventh and I do apologize I went out of town to Oklahoma for four days and when I came back I was swamped like I was constantly have to work my girls have so many programs during the week so it was like it was hard for me to do anything and then within a couple of weeks I um, start feeling sick and it was just a lot y'all but um, I just want to let y'all know that um, it's some good news I am pregnant y'all and I'm excited I just found out um, last Saturday actually but I know I had to have been before then because the way my body was feeling, I was feeling sick, I was eating, sleeping a lot, and then I was hurting at work. It was just so much that was like leading up to that point. And what happened was, I'm going to tell y'all, I, me and my husband discussed, you know, because we have been trying for so long and my peers have been so irregular that we decided we weren't going to take no pregnancy tests because we got tired of spending all that money and I was constantly getting a negative. So, um, I pretty much, when, the Wednesday before I found out, I was talking to one of my friends and she was like, yeah, just, um, I was like, well, my husband don't really want me to buy one, but I feel like I want to go to the dollar store and buy one. And she was like, no, I'll just wait it out. Just wait it out. So on my way home, I went to buy, fam I went by the Dollar Tree, y'all. And why did I go in there trying to be sneaky and try to get a pregnancy test? And I said, um, excuse me, ma'am, do y'all have any more pregnancy tests? They was like, no, we're out of them. I was like, wow. So I knew it wasn't meant. So, pretty much that Friday, I bugged my husband about getting one. He was like, no. That Saturday, I bugged my husband about getting one. He was like, okay, you can get one, but then, you know, save it for the week and go ahead and just take it that Friday, which that Friday would have been the 26th. And so, I was like, okay. So, pretty much, I went out. And when I went out, y'all, I went to Dollar Street again, and they had some. So, I said, you know what? I'm going to buy two of them. And when I buy two, I'm going to take one when I go into Walmart and then play it off when I get home like I only bought one. So, I went to Walmart, went to the bathroom, and I didn't know, y'all, that the Dollar Tree tests come with a little thing you got to squeeze and you got to, you know, you're actually supposed to pee in a cup. I know that's a lot. Pee in a cup and then you're supposed to use a squeezy thing and you're supposed to drop it on the pregnancy test. Did not know that. So, y'all... I know it's a lot of information, but I'm over to using the bathroom, and I'm trying to squeeze while I'm using the bathroom. I ain't have no cup, no nothing. So I was like, okay, I had plenty enough on this, you know, on the, I had caught a, a quite a bit in the, what's the name? So, yes. What are you doing, video? Yeah. But, um, uh, that was my husband. But anyways... Um, yeah, so I caught some in the little squeezy thing, and I said, okay, he pretty much got everywhere, y'all, for real, it was crazy, but, um, got everything straight, I went ahead and dropped what I had onto the pregnancy test, and I was like, okay, let me just read the box so I can, like, take up a little time, and things like that, and so I went back, and I was like, let me throw this, um, thing away, and I looked down, y'all, and it was two lines, I said, oh my god i was in there praising god in the bathroom i was like oh i got to get up out of here and i still had to get what i came in walmart to get so i'm all antsy and i'm just like trying to hurry up to get what i needed and i was really ready to just run out of walmart y'all just to tell my husband but i was like you know what no i called my sister told her and so when i got home y'all i played it off and i was like yeah you sure you don't want me to take this test he was like no don't take it i was like okay so then i set up my video Video camera to record his reaction when I told him that I was and so I was like I said baby I'm pregnant he was like stop playing no you're not 
how you know I was like because I took a test him on some show show me so when I showed him he still didn't get it y'all because he was like I don't know how to read these tests so I showed him the line I showed him the line on the box or whatever so he was all excited y'all this will be my husband's first child this was actually be my third child but I'm so excited y'all y'all don't know the trouble that we have been through we have been through a lot trying to be pregnant over two years y'all and I, I mean the devil was just coming in in my mind I mean really just trying to make me feel like I couldn't have no more kids I was um, taking pills Clomid if anybody know what Clomid is Clomid is a pill that helps you ovulate those didn't work I used um, pre-seed pre-seed is another like a lubricant but it's supposed to help the sperm get to you know your egg or whatever we did a lot and nothing worked. I was almost about to pay two hundred dollars just to talk to a doctor to get my wall scraped and that would have been more money to get my wall scraped. But you know what? God had another plan because it did not work out like that. And so um the enemy was busy. He tried to come in, try to come in between me and my husband and you know, fussing or whatever, but it's like God just showed up and showed out, y'all, and it's like when we came together and we really we wasn't really even thinking about it and i think that's all everybody always says that when you're not thinking about getting pregnant thinking about none of that it's like it happened and it did happen for us and it's like god i'm just so excited and so i've been waiting to tell y'all because i'm like i really want to tell a whole lot of people but of course you know once you tell a few people in your family everybody gonna find out but um i was like i have to come on youtube and share this with y'all i have to and so y'all i have been feeling i have not been feeling sick i have not been throwing up or nothing but i've been feeling queasy a little bit I, my stomach i have like feel like pressure my back has been killing me so um i'm in the midst of was supposed to be um getting ready to become assistant manager at my job at this point i don't think i'm going to take it because the pressure i'm already feeling is not good so i need to go ahead and just get a job where i can sit down so i'm gonna apply for a different job i'm gonna miss my job but i mean at this point i have to do what i gotta do so y'all i'm about two months now and so i will be having to you know get what i need medicaid wick all that stuff it's just a lot i gotta do i still haven't made my ob appointment of course because um my um i have to apply for medicaid which i did that i just got to turn in some more information i got to turn in my pregnancy um verification which i already got that done or whatever so um i'm good to go on that but once i get my medicaid in hand then i can go ahead and schedule my lb and then yeah but other than that y'all i want to start tracking my um pregnancy and so just showing you the progress or telling you the progress of my pregnancy or whatever because this is just a lovely moment right now i'm just so excited my baby girl y'all just turned seven on friday so it's been over seven years now that i have been waiting and it's like no we're well, not waiting to get pregnant but seven years that is like now i'm pregnant and i haven't been on no birth control or anything like that the whole time i was you know been with my husband i've been with my husband be three years um in december and so you know i don't know but god had his own time and i'm just so happy and so grateful but i've tried to post um, a video from my flip camera I don't know what's going on with it I actually did a video on Thanksgiving and it just did not work I don't know so I'm on my laptop right now um, recording this video and so other than that I don't want to go to the emergency room because I like I said I have been feeling some pressure down below but as long as I'm resting and I get in the bed and I sleep or whatever it helps me out a lot and then also, I just try to drink plenty of water. That's my main thing. But anyways, um, I just want to say, I hope everybody is doing well. And I hope that everybody had a great Thanksgiving, ate good. And so, um, please hit me up. You know, leave a message, inbox me, subscribe, anything, because I really want to um, take y'all on my journey with this pregnancy because I know a lot of y'all have been 
standing behind me and my husband and, and you know and praying and you know wanting us to um be pregnant as well and so god has finally did it and i'm just excited but anyways um i guess i will talk to y'all later thank you to all my subscribers that i have i just been blown away every time i look on my phone i'm like somebody subscribing to my channel and even though i haven't even made a video and i don't know how long but they still subscribing and i thank you for what i have because if it wasn't for you i would not have what i have but anyways y'all much love to y'all blessings and and i just i'm excited so please let me know how everybody's been doing and i guess i'll go bye